I was in a little nasty mood. Your smile and your words have just. But that makes back. the two of us. I've been in a nasty mood also all like day. Let's change it. Let's change it for us now. Thank you so much, Amit, uh, for speaking to Good Times. I can say the lockdown has been most productive for you because on every platform there is something by you. If not a film, there is a web series. So, did you even anticipate this? I'm. I won't even hide my excitement and my happiness because I will get caught. <laughs> uh, I can just say there have been a lot of uh, weight on me. in terms of my work and about things going on with my career and i just feel like you know isko hindi mein ek line hai vidhi ka vidhan bolte hai ji you know when the universe decides to kind of support you it supports you so i'm happy i'm just happy things are coming out breathe is coming out you know and you know i'm just i'm happy i'm happy and i'm and we are happy to speak to you also so now breathe this is the season 2 you were in season 1 but now we will see a different uh, side of kabir uh, there would be his story so tell us a bit about that and what had made you say yes when you were signed on for the first season as well i mean i i'm a part of breathe now till the time breathe is there i i listen until the writers and amazon get pissed of me <laughs> and they bump me off but i don't give them any reason um i still remember vikram malhotra vikram sir i call him vikram sir of abundantia who's the creator producer of breed calling me about 2016 no work no films nothing and he just called me he said kaise office aa jao and he just gave me this role i said okay great so from giving such a beautiful role to me on a platter Of course, I worked hard, and uh, by the love of audiences and people, you know, season one was very, very successful. But the the journey of the two is like season two, new season. I think we've all upped the game. And when I say that, so you see the visuals, you see the great marketing that Amazon marketing team is doing, the visuals, and but this all stems from great writing. So, if you ask me, the biggest, like the jump or the change from season one to season two, is the effort of the writing team. You know, which has some really very powerful names: Devani Ayer, Vikram Dulli, Arshad, Mayank, who's a director, creator, and writer. And I think it's their vision, their hard work, their pushing on these characters and this new story that. um you know that has helped us to create this world and for me as an actor i just uh, i just love the way the new i mean you know this kavi with this dimension and uh, uh, we worked very hard especially mayank and me we worked very very closely like we almost i remember an example on in any time we were shooting on the road and i'm very communicative i'm very very beautiful relationship with my fans it's almost like they reprimand me sometimes i i correct them sometimes it's very very equal and they actually i don't even like calling them fans and i remember somebody messaging me amit i not i didn't think that you you are a rude guy then i had to message and hey they don't i i will never be rude to my director this is how we talk so me and mayank are like very 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 like like sometimes it's heaty and sometimes it's sometimes we just look at each other and we communicate and uh, we've tried in the context to the story to create uh, to bring kabir back you know and uh, i just hope when people see it they find the story and kabir fascinating so did you resonate with kabir and how do you say yes to your characters i mean uh, how do you choose your characters as an actor i mean what's your uh, mindset pooja i think uh, kabir chose me i also think that of course i work hard and even to the physicality and getting that and all that i don't like talking too much of my to process because i think it's boring and the audience doesn't care they want and i think your work should be your 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 your, your life should be seen in what you do than just like boring people but i definitely want to tell you that it is uh, 
uh, sometimes it's very difficult to be Kabir because he's so perplexed and like twisted. But uh, sometimes it's very easy to be Kabir because I think I'm very, very close to Kabir fundamentally. Like uh, the way he, he's a protector, he, um, you know, he's, he's a guy who, who fights his own battle. You know, and that is courage, that is strength. And he's a man who fights for the world, for children, for families, and he understands. And being so broken, being broken, being without a daughter and a wife now, he still has so much empathy and concern for other people is what I just love about this man. You know? so. so one of your fans has asked me to ask you, since you have worked with uh, Mr. Bachchan Sr., and you have Bachchan Jr. here, एक similarity और एक dissimilarity दोनों के बीच में आपने क्या observe किया on the set? I think I will not talk about their similarity or their dissimilarity. I will talk about the change in me. Sure. You know, so when you are shooting with Mr. Bachchan and he was Sarkar and I was Chiku and Chiku was very animated and very like you know, so action और cut के बीच में तो मैं चढ़ जाता था सरकार के ऊपर. और जैसे ही कट होता था इस लाइक अमिताभ बच्चन का सामने बैठा हुआ so this should literally like a like i used to creep back like one step at a time calm down come back to reality you are standing in front of amitabh bachchan with abhishek uh it doesn't happen like that a of course he's my senior he doesn't make you feel like that a, and he's just too cool you know so with with abhishek it's like you know after cut i can say bro i need coffee and then he'll get you the best coffee Sure. You know, and he's got this wacko sense of humor, which I feel that you know can only have someone else who can match up with it. Otherwise, you're always at a loss of words about how to answer back to his repartees. Absolutely. And so when I have a better answer to that, I said when you have someone of that caliber and humor, stop. Uh, chup chup, suno, enjoy karo. <laughs> yeah, I'll take that. And another thing about you, Amit, is your transformation. I mean, as I said, we met seven years ago, and now I mean, the way you're on your fitness and everything, you've just completely transformed yourself. Thank you, Pooja. But life is not about fit, uh, fitness transformation. Um, uh, I'm grateful that you see that, but I would like to. Uh, I think when we transform from within, yes, is where uh, that transformation I'm interested in. To be honest, I don't care much about fitness. because as an as an actor as an artist this more to our lives and i think in india we just pay too many too much attention to like how i'm looking and how like i want to have friends and people who meet me and talk to me and don't say how good you're looking oh tumhare baal bahut acche lag rahe ho oh tumne bade like can we cut this crap out of life and just like listen to each other and be warm with each other and like see the growth in each other and the energy and all that but uh, i'm uh, i'm in a happy space Much, much more balanced than seven years you had met me, <laughs> and I contribute that to a lot of people, a lot of books and life. You know, it's really interesting because you're being so honest about it. We've all go through our own struggles, and everyone now at the moment is struggling also. You know, there has been, as you said, there wasn't work for some time. Then you got this. What brought that change? What was it like? I'm sure there are many people who want to hear that from you. Somebody who's been in that, you know, moment. Has struggled, has fought his own, you know, fought his own insecurities, and now, when things are okay, I mean, they're back on track. So I think um, I mean I have two aspects on this, Pooja. One is that everything is not okay. Okay, but I'm not saying this sadly. No, no, no. You know, it's all as we it, all work in progress, yeah. You know exactly. So everything is not okay. I think, but when you realize everything is a phase. you know everything is a phase everything is not okay but then as opera says and i love opera and i it was one line super sundays with opera do you no 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 i saw only one episode of opera 15 years back and the only one line okay has resonated with me and kept me up to that i've never seen anything of her i mean of course i mean we we I mean, she's everywhere but uh, i i was with my ex girlfriend and we were watching this show and i was like cribbing like what the hell are we doing and then there was a line she said you know everything will be okay Strangely, Bujaj is the first time I'm telling someone, and I'm telling you. I don't know. I will, I knew that your and my interview is going to be a little, you know. And he's sitting in front of me, and he's agreeing. Um, oh. I just, I think that line just stuck with me. Everything will be okay. So on my down day, 
you know, when I'm drowning or when I'm slipping, I just said that to myself, you know, it'll be okay. And when I'm happy, when everything is great, I tell myself, this is a phase. So, jada khushi mein pagal mat ho jao, zada dukh mein pareshan mat. You know, that's what they say, enjoy what is to enjoy and suffer what is to suffer. That's what life is. And as an artist, I think it's so important. And I just think it's important to keep quiet. I think we talk too much. Yeah. And I think we, I just hope there's an ecosystem where we can at least let artists be quiet, preserve them. Uh, even like journalists, like you, I can feel like, you know, the way you are listening to me and the way you are giving me, you know, the way you are asking me questions. That means that shows that what a beautiful human being you are. You know, and I just feel that we need to create an ecosystem of understanding and these conversations to reach out to public so they understand, okay, they talk, we talk these things as well. There's more to us than, you know, um, uh, than, than airport looks and uh, this and that. We do that, yes, but there's more to us and which is the truth and I just hope that ecosystem kind of widens and I guess because everybody, as you said, looks at the superficiality of it all. How you're no, looking, I, you're I don't looking. agree with you. No, Pooja. They don't huh? look at superficial audiences. The God. They no, no, smart. I'm not talking about the audience. I'm just talking uh, about people. We in show them. On social media. Yeah. No, we show them. Aap jo if I sit here like a pompous prick and like show you that I'm cool and nothing affects me, it'll come across. But if I stand there hard to art, you know what? Yeah. I don't care. You want to judge me. Don't judge me. You hate me. This is who I am and I'm very comfortable. At least somebody will get it. Okay, fine. This is how he is. So I think superficiality is not understood. You are what you show the world is seen. I just hope we learn as artists, as an industry, as people. We just learn to show other aspects also. I'm not criticizing what's already in place. Yeah. You know, I'm, I'm, I never criticize anything. I just think that if we can widen, you know, and then show the good, show struggles and show these beautiful stories that come out of movie business or or Indian film industry that is hope and if I for me I think like you said earlier in your interview if you ask me I don't take anything seriously but I want to be hope Absolutely. You know, I want to be hope for a million people and I want to be hope for myself awesome and are you seeing that change happening in terms of content now with the OTT platforms that have come and also the industry is also being pushed to create content because as you said, it's the audience that makes or breaks your content yes. and they are not silly. Give them no, good content no, no. irrespective of who's in it, they will watch. Yeah, and I think that's, again, that's, I, I feel that Buja, that should be the leap we take as a country. And now we are talking like very narrow in terms of the film fraternity because that's what we need to present. But I just think in every avenue, that's the leap we need to take. Yeah. You know, um, and uh, it's people. So viewers are people, making films are people. Everyone needs to introspect without the Kali Galoj and without criticizing each other, without undermining. They go, two wrongs don't make a right. Yeah. You know, and I just think that we have to, I always say we need to create an ecosystem. How I can be a part of that, I always believe changing you is changing the world. So I keep rectifying myself, how I'm talking, what am I saying? You know, is it social act? Is this politically incorrect? Is this, is this just awareness, awareness, awareness? And we need, we can't say, we can't be careless. Yes. You can't say, oh, you know, I'm going to say what comes in my heart. No, you can't. Because everything you say is affecting someone, is becoming someone's voice. So I think all people of privilege, of uh, social standing, of who, you know, people who have platform, people who have an avenue of people who are being heard. I think they have to be very, 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 very responsible. Awesome. I rightly said, and now you have a film coming. Somebody's asked me, what was it like to work with the real human computer with their violin? What was that experience like? I won't ask Everybody, you much about it because we'll talk about that later. But just your okay. experience because that, it's just been know, announced, yeah. the release. With their violin as one person, I can talk about any time. <laughs> so what was that like? Uh, so it was a dream come true, though I'm really upset that I didn't get to play her lover. <laughs> but we've uh, we've sorted that out. I mean, Sid don't. I mean, Sid won't. Sid, just just professional acting. I'm talking about. Sid is like an elder brother to me. He's like a mentor to me. So I, he's gonna whack me. Um, I think she's the best actor in the country. Um, again, I'm not one, two, three. She's like one of the best performers, best actors. And the reason I love her because she's a, such a, such a beautiful human being. 
you know and she treats everyone equally for me that is only one quality i'm looking for in everyone in india because that is only one thing that has to change in india koi bhagwan nahi hai aur koi naukar nahi hai we all are same and that's what i love about vidya and uh, shakuntala devi is a very special film i am a teeny meeny part of this you know i'm a very beautiful part of this beautiful film and uh, i'm sure we'll talk about it some day soon absolutely and uh, agar aap actor nahi hote to aap kya hote kya hamesha acting pe hi focus tha ki come what may yehi kar no 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 acting came to me very late you know and uh, like aur kya hota i think uh, bike mechanic hota या बाइक रेसर होता आपकी फोटोग्राफ्स देखी हमने बाइक के साथ मे बी यू टू अ मिशन इम्पॉसिबल और अ फास्ट आप माइंड में घुसना चाहते हो एंड यू नो प्ले Mind नहीं कुछ लोग हैं जिनके दिल में घुसना चाहता हूँ माइंड में किसी के नहीं घुसना चाहता किसके दिल में घुसना चाहता है बता दो यार यू 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 नो आई 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 टोल्ड माय 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 फाइट बैटल्स एंड माय ओन वॉर्स लवली स्पीकिंग टू अमित एंड एक बता दो Or what do you think has changed in the seven years since you've been part of the industry? You've also struggled. So, but strife. change in me, uh, Pooja, or the change in the industry, or what? Both, what? both, both changes. Many uh, many change. Yeah, I think many many fear come. Hogya. You know, before I was very scared. Now I am not scared anymore. I am not scared. I think his confidence, jo hai, wo, that comes from fans, and I don't like calling fans because that's like. Okay, I fine. hate in India we should have to stop. You know how actors call? Yeah, my tribe. Hai, yeah, my army. Yeah, okay. hey, Indian Sorry. army. Ki army. Hai. I think that's another. Okay, so that has to change. You know how we call our fans with our surname? Ha, nahi, I, think the big, I think that's the biggest way to ridicule fans and viewers. They are viewers. They are your viewers. They are your audience. They are your shoppers. Okay, in which when they love you so much. 10 20% of them become your fan they're not your tribe what a pusher is this bad one bad one my bad you know they're not your army i will never call my i will never i used to you. hate the word groupies i used to hate no, it no like i people call like your surname with their with their with their surname i think it's pusher to stop yeah. in india again like yes and you know india yeah. mein zamedari ka waqt khatam ho chuka hai ma'am angrez ja chuke everybody is equal yes I think uh, give love, be fans, but I just think that. Um, uh, but again, the, so that's one change I feel, and it's also very industry like media driven. Media uses these words, and I don't know what, who does this. I will never do that. So that's one thing I would like to change. And another thing I like to change, I think, is uh, uh, is just that I think uh, when we shoot, I just hope, I just wish that there was more discipline. I just think we still lack in a lot of discipline. Yes. And anyways, are you like and actors love their movies being released in theaters, but I don't know theaters kab chahenge. Are you okay with you know movies being streamed on digital? And I mean the viewership would be a lot more, and you're not bogged down by the box office. So you kind of reason and argue and debate when there's an option. Right now there's no option, but um, it's all opportunity every every calamity every problem every hurdle is a is an opportunity for something uh, life is a great equalizer it balances uh, right now there is abundance of ott you know i am happy i'm not complaining a lot of my work is coming out uh, but this will change like i said life is a phase movie you know things will get better cinema halls will open i'll be one of the first people you know Excuse me. To rush and go watch a film, so it's all balanced. There's no nobody is threatened. It's a huge world. Many more opportunities will come, and we will live on. And how has the lockdown personally been for you? I mean, this is my last question. How has it been for you? I think very, very privileged. Can't complain. I mean, there were days of dip, uh, and 
uh, I think I think I've come out understanding and realizing there's more to life than films. I think sometimes when you struggle so much, it just becomes like a loop, and you don't come out of it. You know, film, next film, what will happen? I think these three months have just showed me like calm down, live life, and find life in life, not in films. Well said, Amit. Thank you so much. All the Thank very you. best. Thank you, Pooja. And may the force be with you. And hope God to see you, you in a Mission Impossible. Thank you so much. Never Thanks know. so much. God bless you. Bye. Thank you. Bye. you Thank you, Pooja. Bye. Bye. Thank Bye. you. Bye. 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 Bye.